We want to now take you live to Naval Base San Diego, where the crews of three ships just returned. Tension reporter Jared Aarons, you can see him there, showing us the homecoming for all these families just in time for the holidays, Jared. Yeah, very happy holidays, Virginia. See the crowd behind me of people still waiting to greet their sailors and Marines and welcome them home after they've been gone for seven months, just in time for Christmas. And that's why this morning we've seen signs like welcome ho ho home or even uh, daddy is the best gift. One I saw said all I want for Christmas is you. I cannot wait until we get home because I'm going to snuggle up with my mom and I'm never going to let her go. So adorable. That is the plan for Serenity Andrews and her brother Antonio for when their mom, Rochelle, gets off the boat. They waited with a giant sign that they had signed by nearly 100 friends and family. 4,500 sailors returned today from a mission in the Middle East and the Pacific Ocean, which included airstrikes against ISIL. Our cameras were rolling as Brittany and Jeremy Masiello got that ceremonial first kiss off the boat. It's their first deployment since they got married. I tried to stay busy. Um, I was in school and then I work and I would visit family. Um, so I just tried to like constantly be doing something so that way the time would go by fast. That was just the first ship of three that are coming back. It's the USS Essex, Anchorage and Alaska. In fact, if you look over this way, you see some sailors getting ready to get off of another boat in just the next few minutes. Reunions like this will play out all morning long. Live at Naval Base San Diego, Jared Ahrens, 10 News. Great stuff, Jared. Thank you very much.